Oh, what's good, everybody? I said I was gonna do a second video, so here's my second video. Oh, I think not. I think, but earlier I did a word of the day video, so on this one I'm just gonna do me rambling, get content in, and then later on, you know, post my interviews and uh, work out for the night. I don't want it. It might be resting. No, it won't be. Y'all yeah, want to hear something funny but not funny? I had a really, really fucked up realization about myself. I legit would make an easy ass lick. Like, if you were to do something sneaky to me and, like, try to rob me, you probably would get away with it. Only reason I say that. I'm just now realizing that I'm still missing items, additional items from when someone stole from me. To make a long story short, nah, not even. There's this uh, mechanic shop in Fayetteville. I'm not going to say it because I don't want to ruin the reputation of this shop. Pet boys, but nah, nah, we got two of them in Fayetteville, so I don't think a lot of people like they, they just have to figure it out for themselves which one it is. But um, this was two years ago, I haven't been by there since because it was just I thought I replaced all my well, I just replaced it now. Um, I got my turn in for tomorrow, so I was going down the list of uh of things that I'm gonna need for my turning and I realize I'm missing something like a, a very particular item that I'm gonna need for my turning and I was like it's a tent and I was talking to myself I said how in the fuck do you lose a whole tent like that's just you know we got little pouches and you know little components but I was like you just don't lose a whole damn sleep system and anyway I had remembered when my car and how my car got broken into which was weird, like, I don't, I'm really naive to things, like, certain aspects of the game, the game being life, but I, it was about two years ago, I took my uh, vehicle in, don't ever go to Pet Boys, y'all, just in general, like, they got my ass, I'm over here, like, thinking about just overall, between what I paid them, and then me being robbed that day, it was just, anyway, I was already frustrated with them, so I just wanted to get my vehicle, like, out of their damn lot. But the next day, like, when I had went to go pick up my car, because, uh, and, you know, I was mentally gone and shit. I just didn't feel like dealing with life that day, so I said, you know what? I'm going to pick up my vehicle tomorrow. I go to pick my shit up. I thought it was weird, but, like, I keep a shitload. Or I used to, not anymore. But I would keep a shitload of quarters. This is how much of a petty thief that I got robbed by. But I would keep a shitload of quarters in my um in my cup holder, you know, just because. When I mean like a shitload, I'm pretty sure I had at least, I say, you know, eleven, twelve dollars worth of quarters and dimes and pennies or whatever. So I was like, okay, that's weird. Like, cause you, you kind of know because when 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 certain shit is stacked, like my phone would like sit up a little bit because that's just how knee deep in quarters my shit was but anyway i was like huh pretty sure there was quarters in there but what should have set off a red flag but didn't uh my credit cards they're military you can't use them like you can't use them in off post or anything like that so they were on the ground like somebody had looked through them like you know how somebody would look through some shit like let's say you holding credit cards like this and somebody looking they just tossing them they were on the ground i was like huh i ain't nigga that's weird but anyway i ain't think nothing much of it again i was just so done with the day whatever whatever cool i was like and plus a lot of weird shit be happening around me any goddamn way so but anyway fast forward i think a month goes by because I went on leave and you know work related shit I just I got two different cars I got this and I got my Impala that I got my it was my Impala 
I got this and I got my Impala. That's my work car. Anyway, so we were getting ready for a, a field exercise and I keep everything like in my trunk, whether it be my tent, uh, my flicks, just all my equipment in my trunk. It's like three major items, but either way, they stay in the trunk. They just, you know, don't ever do that for people who want to join the military and the military. Don't ever do that. For some people probably watching this, they're like, well, uh, duh. Well, hey, play as fuck up. Anyway, I go to get my shit ready, and I'm like, I'm missing a lot of shit, dude. Like, from my flick, my soap pack, which was weird, because the only thing the motherfucker didn't take was my funky-ass sleeping bag. You don't take the sleeping bag, but you take the tent. You take the quarters. I don't know, man. Like, I don't know. That was a definition of a thief, in my humble opinion. Like, a thief. Well, nah, because he didn't take everything. I feel like when somebody robbing you, if somebody, somebody robbing you and you know them, they take specific things. But somebody that don't know you, they pretty much just take everything. I pretty much got got for everything except my funky ass sleeping bag. So, but anyway, fast forward now, I realize again that I don't got my tent. And I was like, I said, oh, but I haven't been to the field. Well, except that one time when I did it for field prep. But ever since then, no, I have. It's just that they make us not go out there with our tents. Anyway, me, conclusion in the ramble, your boy got got. I'd be an easy lick because let's say you steal from me. Depending on what it is, I probably wouldn't even notice it until like, let me get over, let me get over, let me get over the hill, go. And yeah, that motherfucker almost got an accident. Could have been me. But yeah, um, like, so like prime example, and I pray this never happens to me. I don't want to manifest, like prime example. I have a lot of fucking shoes, right? So let's say somebody wanted to get me from my ones because also too I've sold and resold I don't well nah never mind I don't want to say this and like somebody's like oh you don't think I got you motherfucker but if somebody were to come in my shit and take like two to three ones at a time like let's say you did that to me for like seven months I wouldn't notice because that wouldn't even still be half my stock you feel me I don't know I feel like I said all this to say this, this is just content and to give y'all a story, give y'all something to laugh at too, but it was just, I don't know, I feel like as materialistic as I am, regardless if it's my personal life or fucking the military, I would be up on that. It took me getting ready for this turn in to realize that something else was stolen from me. That kind of bothers me and you know, my head and my memory be a little foggy or whatever, whatever. I'm gonna be so mad if I'm making this video and I find that damn tent and I'm like, huh. So I guess it wasn't one of those, but I don't know, even still, it was just like, in the back of my mind, I'm thinking, how the fuck, do unless again, it was part of the shit that was stolen from me. In the back of my mind, I'm going, well, how the fuck do you lose a tent? Hey, but teach his own. But yeah, y'all, I uh, I wanted to do another video check-in. Uh, my temperament is still good. Word of the day from earlier is still uh, anxiety and all that other stuff. Um, adventure. I kind of want to get into that before the year is up. Like I said, I got some major plans coming up. It's gonna take a, to require a lot of a lot of patience, but I got plans, y'all, and I can't wait for y'all to see how things kind of like unfold for me, if that makes sense. So. Also, too, y'all ever wonder why they always do state fairs like in the fall? I feel like it's too cold to be going out, right? Well, nah, cause. I dress the best, like in thermals and jeans and in boots. So maybe I misspoke, but I feel like fairs, like is like to me more of a could be misspeaking, but more of a uh, a summer activity, dude. You know. So, 
but yeah, there's a. I think I want to go to the state fair, state fair here in North Carolina. Getting a little chilly outside, which I don't mind. I kind of, not kind of. I do very much enjoy cold weather. So, on another note, I really might just go get some ramen too. I have a I've gone back to eating like healthier meals, if that makes sense. Hey, mama. Ah. Y'all forgive me. If I see something that looks good, I'm gonna acknowledge it. I'm not a pervert, I promise you. But yeah. Fucking. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get some more. But yeah, my bad, y'all, for the ramp. Hey, mama. God damn. What are these fine specimens doing out in the cold? But anyway, now nah, let me stop. I wanted to bring y'all with the new phone I go to the car wash. So. Damn. You know what was I was talking about? State fair and what else? Oh, yeah, going to go get some ramen. Yeah. More of a story. I'd be an easy lick. I'm glad I'm down here like. I feel like if I was in a fast-paced, like, city, a lot of people would be able to pick up on that. I think I just need to get, like, overall better at, like, accounting for certain shit. Hopefully y'all heard me this whole time I made this video. I know when I make a video on the mount and it's blowing, like, hot air the way that it is, it's hard for y'all to hear me. Hmm. I tell you one thing, no bitches, they come, they go. Y'all give me some ideas as far as you motherfucking you. I know when I can't multitask for shit. Had to get Bet Betsy a little sure. Kind of close, ain't it? Ooh. Hmm. Yeah, I ain't gonna be able to hear me for the next couple of minutes, so just bear with the sound. There we go. So I get the special treatment because ain't nobody coming through the line, huh? Well, there's like one person behind me, if y'all can see that. But yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think I got enough time.
ठीक है Sorry about that, y'all. So interesting enough, right? The 2024 Mustangs, it is like all a digital path from the speedometer to the uh, gas gauge. It's like one big ass, long ass, like iPad. Shit, so fucking future, futuristic. It was computer-based too, so well, obviously, but like when the car was at a stop, it would turn off and then turn back on. Like, that's a little bit scary. I feel like, I don't think that's necessary for a vehicle, but that was a little bit scary. I, I was like, why? For what? If I do, well, no, when, if I, I don't know. I'll see how I feel after I eat some ramen and do Sparking Zero for an hour. You wasted my time, bitch. 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 Mm -hmm. I'm gonna cut the video once I pull into the ramen parking lot, y'all, so just bear with me. Again, because I have an attention span of a squirrel. Oh. Hmm. I think I pretty much touched on the things I wanted to touch on earlier. I don't see how some content, so some content creators, like on YouTube, no, like on Instagram. So I went from posting three to literally six times a day. At this point, I'm just like, fuck you algorithm. But um, content creators on YouTube, it's easy to post a short or a reel. But like, I know some content creators on YouTube that post like three, four videos a day and they're relevant. It's kind of like, what are y'all doing to, to... Well, I know what they're doing, but it's kind of like... It's not like I'm really talking to you. I'm just talking through you. Through a... Uh, through this. I'm not, like, giving you a response or anything. I can go through the comments later if I want to, but... I don't know. It's, I don't see how some content creators do that. then again too i know there's this one content creator that i uh that i watch and like some of the topics he, he addresses is kind of like like all right now is this this politics shit is getting old after a while you know i i can't do that Maybe I should start making content where I just, outside of shorts, like I, uh, I sit down and I talk with people. You think that would be better? Not like an interview, but just like regular interactions. Block it ready, man. What the fuck you think? Should I just wanted to know? I start blasting.
fish bowl earlier and I'm still hungry. That's crazy. On another note, I started deadlifting again yesterday. Still struggling with 315 opposed to what I used to be able to pull. But it is literally back to the basics for me. That's sad. I can make like he makes full blown skits. I don't think I could ever do that. You know how some people like they are their content, like they can put on a wig and you know act out like both gender roles. I think that's actually pretty cool as a content creator. It kind of says that you like you really do live. But you really do live in your own little world and can't nobody tell you nothing like. I feel like people who do that, like they're very aware of self. They know how to, to go into character. That I don't know how to do. I will say I wish I could give people multiple characters of myself. That way I know how to deal with people accordingly. I don't know how to do that. I think that's a very good uh, skill set to have. Like you're going to put on this persona for this situation with this person. Or you're going to put on this persona for this situation and that person. I know I'm yawning y'all, but once that pre-workout get in my system, it's over. Or I legit might take a rest. I don't know. I think I have a good excuse to take one. Somebody will probably watch this. Boy, you better. Well, you better take your ass to sleep. I do what I want, goddammit. I am an adult. I will say this, though. I feel great after rest days, man. Anyway, I'm about to come to a close, y'all. Thank y'all for it. For those who stayed all the way, thank y'all for watching this video all the way through. You'll know by 9 o'clock if I'm in the gym or not. But about to get some ramen, go back to the crib, post these interviews and videos, and we'll see how I'm feeling. Y'all be good and y'all be blessed, all right? I'll see y'all tomorrow. Peace.